distribution and also the content consumption. A section of uh, political leaders from the Mount Kenya region is asking their colleagues to put a stop to divisive politics, which says, which they say is hurting the country at a time when the nation should be united. The Kenya Kwanzaa allied leaders spoke in Laikipia in a pardon reference to the planned Lemuru 3 conference of Mount Kenya leaders. However, NAC Kenya leader Martha Karua and Jubilee Secretary General Jeremiah Kioni have insisted that Lemuru 3, which is scheduled for Friday this week, will continue as planned. Clement Masombo has the details. As politics continue to gain momentum in the country, political leaders aligned to the Kenya Kwanzaa side have sent an appeal to their colleagues to stop divisive politics. Led by the leader of majority in the National Assembly, Kimani Shungwa, the leaders said Kenya is beyond politics of dividing Kenyans along tribal lines. <laughs> ya kuhakikisha tunatumia nafasi zetu kwa serikali kuleta maendeleo kwa wananchi wetu. And I want to agree with Mheshimiwa Kionjori. We have no reason. Hatuna sababu yoyote ya kurudisha wananchi wetu kwa siasa za misingi ya ukabila. Hatuwezi kuwa na serikali moja na ni serikali mbili. Lazima iwe ni serikali moja inaongozwa na William Samoei Ruto. Kama ujatocheka na hiyo serikali, enda uda yako uko kando. Ama uko jembe ya kamitatu, enda uga serikali yako. They castigated other leaders for planning meetings, which they said aimed at creating divisions in the country at the expense of uniting Kenyans. So please, let us not allow ourselves to be taken back to the politics of ethnic mobilization. If we want to mobilize our people, let us mobilize our people behind ideas. Ikakuwa established a committee called Intergovernmental Budget and Economic Council. Na hiyo diyo mahari cooperation and consultation from all organs of government sit under the chairman of Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya. That is where cooperation and consultation is done. The leaders spoke in Nanyuki during the groundbreaking ceremony for the construction of the Nanyuki open air market. Na kwa hivyo na kwa sababu iko na all the facilities tafadhali tuungane pamoja to support to support contractors wetu na tumekubaliana siku ya leo all wafanyikazi wa hii soko wale watakuwa na chiba wanajeka wanasaidia kwa mjengo watatoka katika Laikipia county. Karibu niwaambie soko yetu tutajenga na tutahakikisha mambo mengi yaendelee. Elsewhere, the NAC Kenya party leader Martha Karua and Jubilee Party Secretary General Jeremiah Kioni have vowed to continue with their plans to have the Limuru 3 meeting. We've talked about leadership generally. We did not give any exception. That is the answer to that. Whether we expect that there will be any people, any disruptors, we have just given a caution generally and that's it they spoke after they were given a green light to hold their meeting by the kikuyu council of elders the council of elders said the meeting will discuss issues affecting the mount kenya region we must have our say even in taxation you cannot be taxed by force so in rimuru 3 we are going to express our views and we are saying from now onwards we are going to determine our future the Limuru 3 meeting is scheduled from Friday, May the 17th. Clement Masombo, KTA News, Nanyuki. Trade CS meets exhibition agents ahead of President William Ruto's 